Father and son made their first court appearance today in a tragic shooting that killed four at Georgia's Appalachie High School. The 14-year-old shooting suspect, Colt Gray, appeared just before his father, Colin, or Colin Gray, I should say. Both are now charged in those shootings. Libyana Talmese is outside the high school with new details just released today in court. Terrence Sylvia, the shooting suspect, was shackled around the waist and he spoke very softly when asked questions. And his father, Colin Gray, rocked back and forth and even cried as he listened to the judge. The judge told the dad he faces up to 180 years in prison if he's convicted on charges, including second degree murder. The father is accused of providing the gun that investigators say his son used to murder two students and two teachers and wound nine others. Local investigators interviewed him and his son last year after the son was accused of making a threat online. Let me ask you this, do you have, any, do you have weapons in the house? I do. Are they accessible to him? They are. I mean, there's not, nothing loaded, but they are down. Okay. We, do, we actually, we do a lot of shooting. We do a lot of deer hunting. He shot his first deer this year. I'm trying to teach him about firearms and safety and how to do it all and get him in, interested in the outdoors. Mm -hmm. Picture on my phone is him with blood on his cheeks from shooting his first deer. It was just the greatest day ever. Yeah, so sure. he knows the seriousness of weapons and what they can do and how to use them and not use them. It's only the second time a parent has ever been charged in a school shooting. The DA also said today that the accused killer will face more charges related to those who were wounded. Um, when he was taken into custody on Wednesday, we did not have the identities or the conditions of the other victims. So we were not able to charge on those offenses. So when the evidence comes in, and they've been have a chance to heal physically, emotionally, and spiritually. We will get with them, and there will be additional charges that address the other victims in the case. The DA said when those charges come out, there'll be another appearance in court. In Winder, Georgia, Oliviana Calmes, Fox 32, Chicago.